Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a short journal with me video. But before we get started, I wanted to quickly talk about today's sponsor, Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community for creatives where millions come together to take the next step in their creative journey. They have thousands of inspiring classes for creative and curious people on topics ranging from illustration to design to photography and more. Through both video lessons and class projects, you can schedule classes to fit your own schedule and skill level. Skillshare members get unlimited access to thousands of inspiring classes and an annual membership costs less than $10 per month. Recently, I've been really enjoying a class called Color Theory, Get Inspired by Color by Sarah Parkinson Howe, who is a graphic designer. I really enjoyed understanding various color harmonies and how designers pick certain colors from the color wheel to use in their projects. It's summertime now, and whether you're a student or a working professional, I think it's a great time to learn something new. So if you're interested in trying out Skillshare, the first thousand of my subscribers to click the link in the description box will get a two-month free trial of premium membership so that you can explore your creativity too. Now let's move on to my journal. This is my six ring binder that you might have seen a few times already. I finished my previous one earlier this year and I'm planning to do a flip through sometime soon. Because I have a lot of pictures I want to use in this spread, I chose two blank pages to maximize on space. And these are some pictures of magazine covers that I printed at home. They feature the covers that EXO members have been on over the past month or so. After I have my blank pages ready, I'm just starting to lay down some of the pictures to see how they can fit together on the page. And I try to arrange these based on color. Once I have a general idea of where I want everything to go, then it's time to bring out my dot liner and glue everything down. I prefer using a dot liner to glue or double-sided tape because I think it's much cleaner, but it also is very thin, so it won't give the page a bulky feel like double-sided tape would. After all the pictures are on the page, then it's time to cut off the excess pieces. At this point, I like to start adding some stickers for decoration. So here I'm just going through some of my sticker boxes to find ones that I want to use. After a first round of stickers, this is what the page looks like, and at this point, I'm ready to start writing. For this spread, I wasn't exactly sure what I wanted to write in the beginning, so I decided to put down all of the members' names first. Then 
Then for each cover, I decided to write a few lines about the theme. And for Baekhyun and Suho's covers, they're actually supporting COVID-19 relief efforts. So they feature keywords like stay strong and faith. I also included a quote from Seun about how he enjoys wearing suits since it makes him feel different from usual. And I finished off the writing with a quote from Instagram. After I have all my writing done, then I like to go back and fill in any blanks with decorations or more stickers. Here's what it looks like after the first round of stickers and then the finished spread. I think this turned out pretty colorful and cheerful, which is kind of what I was going for. And after repunching the holes on the pages, it's time to put them back into my journal. And that concludes my short journal with me today. I hope you enjoyed watching. And again, if you're interested in learning something new this summer, please head on over to Skillshare via the link in my description. As always, thank you for watching and see you next time.